Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is the part 2 of my Canva tutorial. So in the first part, I've shown you the features of Canva, how to use it, how to design. So for this second part, we will go into the professional level because we will be using our debit email Yes, in using the Canva for education. So without further ado, let us hop into it. So let us go ahead and search on Canva. And step by step, I'll be teaching you how to sign up using your debit email. So next, guys, makikita natin dito, leftmost part of our screen. You can see here the arrow down button. So just click on it. At may makikita kayong get help, click on it. Magpa pop up here. So you can see that there is this like magnifying glass or like search button. Click on it and search or type education. Yan. Tapos guys, meron kayong makikita apply to Canva for education. Click on it. So for this, make sure that you know your Zapad email and your password. Through Canva for Education, teachers can access many of the Canva Pro features for free. Oh my gosh. Currently accepting applications and to learn more about what we offer, visit our application page by clicking here. So dito do time click. Click here. Tapos we will be redirected uh, in this part, apply for Canvas Education Program. Don't worry, I'll be linking it down in the description box at the comment section. But uh, you can go directly there. So the next thing that we need to do is to scroll it down. So the so yeah, application process, check if you're eligible. So it means kasi na kailangan meron kang DAPAD email. Yun. Submit application form. So, meron tayong i-fill out mamaya na form. Wait for feedback. So, yung team nila, they will review it. And after 24 hours, dun mo palang pwedeng magamit. And I'm so excited for this, guys. Kasi, I can use the premium or yung pro na pinakita ko sa inyo. Yung sa first part, for education free. Eligible teachers are approved and granted Canva for education status that will let you utilize Canva Pro features for free. This is really a big deal. All right, so Canva for Education application. In this part, guys, make sure na lahat ng information is true and there are no errors because this is like a one-time thing. Na kapag nasubmit mo, there is no edit response, I think. So, wala nang ganun. So, let me... Just type on my name. So in this part, guys, I just finished filling out the form. So nilagay ko lang dito yung mga personal information, just like the name of the school, teaching position. Tapos meron pa dito ng uh, number of students in the school. Tapos yung pinaka importante is the DepEd yung government agents here are they currently use canva in class so i just clicked on yes do other teachers at your school use canva again i tick yes so for this one so meron kasing the question kasi dito is uh how will you use canva for education Ganyan. so i just said I would like to utilize Canva in making some eye-catching graphics that would entice them and catch their attention. In using, in using this wonderful, sorry, oh my gosh, in using this wonderful online editing application, I can express my inner talents by making educational presentations to the students. So that mga ganyan yung yung essay natin. So yung maximum characters here is 1000 so i can add some more words here para kapag i-review nila it will be approved so kasi I, I don't know kung one time lang ba na pwedeng mag-submit dito and another important thing guys is to attach proof of your teaching qualifications and proof of active employment 
at an eligible school. For this, I can upload photo of certificate of study or government license. So yung upload ko nalang dito is my PRC ID, ganyan. Or photo of employment status at school. So yun. So I'll be just uploading a file here. The picture is my government ID, which is the PRC para sure. Ayan. So, na fill out na natin yung form. The next thing that we need to do is to click on this. I have read and agreed to terms and conditions. So, let me just click on it. Kung ano ba yung nakasaad dun? Just answering, was this article helpful? Yes. Thanks. People also viewed Canva for education guidelines. Ayan na guys. So, what we need to do now is to click on submit. Guys, it is done. So they will just get in touch with me shortly now. So that is after 24 hours. That is it guys. That is how simple you can apply for Cam for Education. All you need to have is all you need to have is your government email address. So in then guys, I hope that when you apply or when you submit your application, it will be approved. Yes, that is it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you find this helpful. If you did, don't forget the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you so much, guys. I love you and goodbye.